Edwardsville, USA. Todd down at the left end of your dial, kicking to the right shirts, the purple pants, and the silver helmets at the right end, the Truman State Bulldog. Back heat for the Bulldogs, wearing number one is Eric Nelson, wearing number 29 is Derek Johnson. Down and gets ready to tee it up. Bulldogs on the feet on the far side. Blazers looking on with concern on the near side. Going to go to the far side of Johnson. Going to field it at the 8 to the 10 to the 15 to the 20, 25, 30, 35, 30. And it's deep to the 50, 35, 40, 35, 30, 25, 20, 15. Look down from behind and it's way dead line. A scintillating kicker. Tailback, he's the man he can add Jarrett Anderson. They got a big pullback in front of him. One outs left and right. They're going to get to Anderson. Dances to the middle. into your radio dial with silver hats ready to get in an early one. Well, I'm still buzzing about that kickoff return. It's going to be put on the goal line. Going to give it to Anderson. Slide ahead across the five to the three to the one. Three first and goal at the one yard line. Harry Menace says, Jared is in the backfield with him. They're poised for glory at the one yard line. First and goal. Anderson right side. Touchdown. Truman State Bulldogs. Missouri. Marks under 11 minutes. Anderson, Anderson cuts 
to the inside, not down right at midfield. He gets across the midfield strike. Morris Smith makes the tackle. Good Anderson so far will try to get some numbers on him after the end of the first quarter. First man through this time. The fullback going to take the football down to the 46-yard line for the Blazers. And two backs in the backfield, wide outs left and right. Six men, everybody comes this time. Morris wants to throw down the field. Smith will kick it away on fourth and five. Here he's got the sure-handed blazer. Catcher is back to receive the football. He's going to circle under it and catch it at the 11-yard line. The 15, that's a little knocked down right at the 19, though. Under center, one long set back behind it. And Truman State jumps offside. Let's see if they were drawn off. Thunderbird continues with the play and is going to overthrow. Thunderbark, the throw short from Gunn and Pinner. Pinner's going to catch it at the 30. Going to go across the 30. Still on his feet. Thunderbird, 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 
Look to throw the short one. Got a man. Going to catch it at the 43. Take it to the 45. And across midfield. Inside one ten for the Bulldogs.
25 yard line to go. It's trailing 28 to 7. Brings him up, wants to throw, comes out to the near side. Oh boy, that one could have been picked off. If we'd have been thinking intercept, Howard Foster has. This time they're going to line that big fullback right. back out there with Jared Anderson. And he's going to come up and uh, fake to Anderson, look to throw the football. Got some time over there. Catch the ball into the big leg at the 31 yard line. But again, it's a first down pass, however, and the Bulldogs still maintain possession of the football at the 42 yard line. All oh, to mistake. And stay on the ground this time across the 45 to the 46 yard line. And then Nate Moose brings up his club. Jared Anderson on the setback. Right out to the left side, one on the right side. And then off to Anderson. Anderson tries to dance outside. And he makes the kick there. And it looks like Truman States, but he's up right on top of it. Jim Orselak, one to seven. Left and right, going to throw over the middle to the tight end. He's going to catch the ball inside Grazer territory at the 40 yard line. This going to change the play at the line of scrimmage. One outs left and right. Got his two backs stacking an eye. Now he splits them out. And the delay. This time is going to go to Jared Anderson. Anderson going to shake free across the 30, down to near the 25 yard line. That's great individual eight. Right at the 26 yard line. A ball is the state player gets in the eight. Eight minutes wants to throw. Rose right looking down the field. Got a man there. One on one coverage. Going to be kicked. Two yard line, but it's Arizona! For Truman State, the Bulldogs at the 26-yard line of the Blazers at the right end of the radio dial. Under seven minutes to play, and now eight minutes looks at Truman State, trailing 28 to 7. Eight minutes, the quarterback transfer from Arizona. Let's see what he does here. He wants to throw the football to quick one out to the left side, and he caught the Blazers. Wrap him up quickly at the 20-yard line. Tail lined up behind this. First man through the down, fourth and a foot at the 16. Quarterback sneak straight ahead, flash down on the near side. Jared Anderson in the backfield with one of those big pullbacks. We have a couple of them back here. Eight minutes to quarterback. We'll go to Jared Anderson. He cuts it to the outside, finds a hole at the 10, gets to the five, still on his feet at the three. Can he get in? Yes, he can. Touchdown. Tremendous State University. Jared Anderson shows why he is a Holland Hill candidate. And the Mike Holmes. Backup quarterback, 6'1", 215 pounds, junior from Washington, Illinois. The kick is up and the kick is done. Tied at 30 19. We'll take a break. 30 second rubber break on the Laser Sports Network. Taken by Ronnie Brown at the 3, to the 5, to the 10, to the 15, down the sideline. Bangs into one of his own players and knocked down at the 18. Two right outside on the right side, one on the left side. Deep drop, a little throw to short and listen, but he takes it at the 15, takes it to the 20, snagged at the 20. Good defensive play. Right. There's Feinberg, has a little chat with his center there. He's got two handbags lined up behind him, spot on the left side this time. The other going to stay on the ground, and listen. Listen comes to the home side of the field at the 25. Blazers in the lead by 14, 14 by the go in the hand. Deep drop by Butterbrook, the big guy wants to clear. Got a man down and down and down and down. And it was there, tips, buddy. Second and 10 for the Blazers. Butterbrook in the gun. Going to throw the short man. Sean Pinner going to catch it at the 38 to the 40 to the 45 to the 47 yard line. Pinner takes their own 47 with 335 to play in a hand. Leading 38 to 14 for the Mercs in the gun. Backs left and right. He wants to throw, however. Now he's going to come this side, left the far side, and he throws out in front of Gary Gump. Here's the vein. He'll be standing in zone 35 when he kicks it away. He's seeing one man back deep. It's a high snap. The vein's going to have to run out of there with it. He's got Bulldogs chasing him everywhere. The vein at the 45 dives to the 46 yard line. A high snap, and then here came the main dogs. And left side. An eye back here. Lined up behind quarterback Nate Minnis. Minnis going to hand off to. Well, he's going to go to the second man through, and that's Jared Minnis. Minnis with two backs behind him, one else left and right. Play fake, looks to throw the ball down the field. Got a man wide open down there, going to catch it at the 10 to the 5 touchdown. Truman State University, Chris Gregg. 
over is Mike Ball. Pick is up and it is good. We got a 28 21 pick up.
this time, the great one, Jared Anderson. That motion man to the far side. Going to go to a fullback straight ahead. Bangs off the right tackle position. Reason will make miss. Here's your fullback right back to behind him. Motion man, James Ross to the far side. The way he had trouble getting there. Snap from center, and it slowed down the play. And as a result, the Bracers are able to scare Anderson. Here's Minnis. And send a man in motion to the district side of the field. Draws the Blazers off sides. Flags go down. And then we go with a quarterback sweep. But I think the cadence to change it. said something to the strike shirt. Tell him he's 10 steps out onto the football field. He wants an explanation of the call. He gets it from the official, but they're not going to take it back, I can tell you that. It's first and 10 for the Bulldogs. Also on the near side hash, first and 10 for the Bulldogs, and eight minutes going all the way to quarterback. Going to fake it, and then Larry Rep looks to throw it down the field. Got a man wide open, going to catch the ball, and he catch it in bounds. Yes, they say he did know that he wiped it out. It was. 10 10 to go in the third quarter. 35 28. Got us to stay in the lead. Truman State with the football. He's second and 10. Back at the 25 yard line. The tight end goes to the opposite side. High back field behind Nate Dennis. Wide out is Gray on the left side. Looking to go to Jarrett Anderson. He's going to try to sneak through that place of goal, but he's going absolutely nowhere. Tell the ball and tail back to the Ministers. Dennis is the quarterback. Deep drop looking as well. Throws it out of the back field. Anderson going to catch it at 25, to the 30, to the 35, to the 36 yard line. It should be and will be. First and 10 for the Truman State Bulldogs at their own 35 yard line. Again, they move the tight end to the opposite end. Plays his four down lineman. But even Jared Anderson out of the back field. He's chasing and running down and coming down at the 32 yard line with a flag down on the near side. In there, about as well as the Lacers. Lacers with the traditional 4 3 defense. Under the line. to state that time to the left side of the field. And Gray on the right side. Lost to fly, running left and Ricky. Comes over the middle, again it's the tight end, and it gets to the second Gary Goff is going to be back deep for the Blazers. Here's the punt with the right foot. The third catch, no he's going to run it out of there. At the 37 yard time, didn't do much to win it. to direct the touchdown drive right here. Play fake, what's the throw over the middle? Going to be caught at the 46 yard line. Yeah, Montreal Mitchell on his right, and he's got, on his left side, he's got, looks like Sean Finner and his Finner. Now he's going to run out of the pocket. Now there's a flag down, he's going to throw it on the run, going to be dropped down at the 45. Two-yard penalty against the Blazers for holding for the left of the Comes from the near side. Bunch of Mitchell out of the backfield. 25 to the 40. And 45 to the 50-yard line. And push it. Under Murphy in the shotgun. Three-step drop. Let them go quickly down the field. Got a man there. Going to overthrow him. Under Murphy in the shotgun on second and ten. Inside Bulldog territory at the 49. Down the field. There's the market. Steps up right behind the aforementioned Mr. London. 
the center position. Runs off to Grissom. Grissom bounces to the outside. The four wings pull down. To the right side. He's got one of the young guys. Now he's getting some pressure. Wants to get out of there. He's running out of there. Wants to throw it down the field. Down there. I would be very surprised if Devane punts it. Let's see what happens. Looking over, here's Devane, and Devane is indeed going to punt it. He's straight up in the air, and he's going to let it bounce. The Blazers is going to try to keep it from going into the end zone. Here's Jared Anderson hit from behind and throw down and for 25. Jared Anderson maybe catch some more passes out of the backfield. Nate Hughes, the quarterback, wide outs left and right. Wants to roll right and throw the football. Now being chased, going to throw it short. Continue to see those in Alabama. 308 to play in the third in this one. Blazers up 228. And this wants to throw. Got some time. Got a man. Going to throw it out in third. And that's for the two and save Bulldogs is Marlon Smith. Smith will be standing in his 15 yard line. He will flip the football. And away. Well, he's going to go with bounce and he's going to take a foul rush to stay down. So, Bonner Mercury's under center, four man rush by the Silvermans from Kirksville, Missouri. He's staying on the ground. This time he's going to give it to Bontrell. Bontrell's going to dance to the 50 yard line. A tremendous lick. Bonner in the deep drop, wants to throw over the middle. Rocket Rodney Brown just took a tremendous blow. Hang on to the football at the 46 yard line. 144 to go in the third, very fake, looking to roll right and throw the football to the tight end. Down the sideline, 30, 25, right over the person at the 20 to the 18 yard line. Here, John Taylor just ran there down the sideline. In the shotgun, here's Funderburg. Looking to get into the end zone once again. Going to throw it out there, finish the catch to the 15, to the 10, to the 5. is under center, 58 takes to go. Nico Cooper goes in motion and goes back to the visitor's side. And he's off to Glisson. Glisson tries to get inside, but he's immediately. Second and five for the Blazers of Hal Mummy. Still at the 13-yard line. Motion man, Nico, to the home side this time. They're going to throw into the end zone. Nico Cooper's there, going to great, and not be able to come down with it. Hey, we're in the third quarter. Blazers lead 32 to the end. Burke's got to run out of there, so he's a short one, right into the hand, fights exactly right. He did three field goals last year, snaps a good one, kicks his off, and it is no good, wide to the right. Sacked earlier in this drive. He's standing on his own five yard line. 
lost a throw down the field, throws it over the head of everybody. There were two blue belts. Mm -hmm. Right in your radio dial, one man back deep for Truman State standing at the 44 yard line. Of VSU. Wayne Devane, the Valhasta High School product, gets a perfect snap, gets it up and away. It is a high floater. We call for a fair catch at the 44 yard line. Truman State intent on putting more numbers on the board. Play fake. Looks down the field. Pumps one. It's going to throw it over the heads of everybody right into the hand. Jared Anderson in the backfield. And Anderson reverses his direction at the field. And then the Blazers took him right there at the 45 yard line. Performance antics in the first half. In the second half, we've seen a low off team instead of a high off team. Deep drop by Menace. He wants to throw down the field. Got an end. Oh, good. Oh, a dead throw by Menace, but they say. Oh, back Gary Goff standing back at the 12 yard line. Truman State is going to want to play Delta State a little bit later on this season. November 2nd, if you want to fly with the Blazers, contact the end of the party. Here's the kick. Truman State puts it high, high up in the air, and it's going to go and bounce into the end zone first. Man. Trip to Paul Parker is certainly looking forward to it. Here's one of our Dunder Center. They can listen to one setback. They're all right. Curry Short is going to land out there and going to be dropped by John Taylor today. I think we're going to gain half a hundred today. Points away. Better work in the shotgun. Looks it well. Comes out this side. Going to be cut. The 22 yard line. Sean Pender. Until Mitchell on his right. Sean Bender on his left. Looking to throw. Short drop. Looking. Got to get out of there. He tries to spin away. Does get away. Now he's going to throw to Pender on the release now. Pender to 23. He'll take it to the 24 yard line. Here's Wayne Devane with the punt. He'll be standing in his own 15 yard line. State has had good field position here in the second half. They just haven't been able to put points on the board. High snap again. The Bane's going to have to run with it again. It'll be smothered at the 18-yard line, and we got a flag down. Summit, Missouri, Junior. Nate Miss, quarterback, going all the way this afternoon. A hot September afternoon. The clouds have rolled away. We have a blue sky again. Tall sweep, left side to Jared Anderson. We're trying to run him down. Jared Anderson cuts it up the field at the 10 to the 9-yard line. Georgia, Hershey Walker football right there. Here we go, 9-yard line. He's going to hold off to Jared Anderson, stopped in the backfield. Now he's still on his field. Anderson's going to go down the sideline, yanked out of bounds at the five yard line. We hit him signal ball. And a hand off to the fullback. He goes straight ahead and lean into the end zone for the touchdown for the Bulldogs of Truman State. Built Yogi again. It's a red bound freshman from Blue Springs, Missouri. Snaps a good one. Kicks up and it is cut. 40. It's like a 60 second network break. This is the Blazer. The right foot, it's a swimmer. They're trying for the onside kick. And let's see, Taylor's going to receive it. Bound us to stay at the offensive now. Money to Howard offense. He's Lance Lunderbrook. Lunderbrook in the shotgun. Back to his left and right. Goes the short one out to the right side. Montreal Mitchell's going to catch it and be hit immediately. If the throw is right in the football game, 235. Bound us to stay in the lead in the scoring. Just a score test. Now they send a the blitz. Everybody comes. Lunderbrook throws it down the field. Territory at the 48 yard line on the far side hand. Yeah, yeah, right into the shotgun. Hands off to Glisson. Glisson cuts it back up field, not down at the 45. He'll pick up two scores. This is a fake right there. He's lying right there. We have six men at the line of scrimmage. Here comes Fulro. Thunderbird's got time to throw. Now he has no time. He's running out of there on the right side. Gets a good block. Pump face and he's knocked out of bounds. One of us got Bunchell Mitchell and Sean Bender flanked on each side of him. He's in the shotgun formation. Slot left this time. We're going to throw it down the field. Got a man down there. Going to catch the ball. It's a 35. It's a 35. It's a 20. Can he shake three? No. They're going to throw it down at the 17-yard line. They're going to throw it down. 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 They're going to throw Pushing for us. Going down lineman for the on-rushing Cutsville, Missouri team. Lundberg, long time with the snap count. Looking over the line. Now he's going to roll right. Look to throw the football. John Taylor is going to catch it for tight end at the 25. That tight end position on the right side. In the backfield, Carlos Brown is back there. The freshman from Valdosta High School. So Sean Pinder in the ticket. David Glisson in the backfield. We're going to get the Glisson. Glisson takes it to the outside at the 20. Cuts it down, bends his knees, and bows his head, and takes it to the... 
Russell out there is Terrell Andrews. We haven't heard much from him today. Here he goes, mid wide to the left side. In the slot on the left side is Sean Dana. And it to David Glisson again. Russell out there. Oh, 